So let's say you have set up your panel trim like this, and you are using so-called Korean bevels to create beveled shading. Once you are done, what you may want to do is optimize your geometry a bit. These vertices here for instance, could be merged. And you could also use Mesh Machine for this by the way. However, what you will end up with is a harsh break in shading. The reason for this is surprisingly found in the UVs. If I undo this, and merge again, you can see how the UVs split. One way to solve this, is in the UV editor, with UV selection sync disabled, just merging the vertices. This can quickly become cumbersome however. And so decal machine provides a stitch tool for this purpose, which can be used directly in the 3D view. It works by first selecting the faces whose internal edges should be stitched, then just running the tool from the edit mode pie. This will fix the harsh shading break. Alternatively, you can also select the edges themselves. I would argue selecting faces is easier though. Note how you can select quite a number of faces, and stitch them properly all at once. Just avoid selecting faces across the inevitable single UV break in a cyclic face loop. And you can also run stitch directly from the UV editor. Understand that decal machine stitch tool, doesn't snap face islands together like Blender's native stitch tool. It only merges to an average location, based on the existing positions of vertex instances in the UV space.